Mr. Moat, I've said it before and I will say it again. We want to apprehend you safely. The man they're hunting is an untrained lone gunman with little or no support. The new bastards have been on to me, right for years. He's a passwordish, harassed, he's just won't leave us alone. Since the first shootings on Saturday, the police have been tapping into the networks that tell them who is doing what and where. Tell them where. Please give yourself up. Tell them where. Please give yourself up. You just have to remove the stone of yours. There's nobody ready I'm in, I'll kill you. I've got two hostages at the minute, right? Somebody ready I'm in, I'll kill them as well. And then he, when he shoots someone, I think, uh, and uh, shoot, kill someone and uh, shoot two others. You may get what, 12 days? And yet, despite everything, Moat is still on the run. It's not impossible that this could go on for days or even weeks. But with so many resources concentrated on the area he's thought to be in, the chances are he'll be found soon. You can't have you running around out there, wasting friendly civilians. I've got a jacket, I've got a dressing gown, I've got some chicken, I've got some bread, I've got a can of lager, I've got a fishing rod, um, I've got my fishing rod. And I'm willing to sit down and just shout, Modi, it's Gaza!